there are already legends here in the VS Cup series. To just be one of them is, you know, just an honor. The competition is really tight, so getting every advantage from your competitors is key to winning. It feels better and thrilling because knowing that we have nothing to lose as young youngsters. I love the whole car. <laughs> it's not even a joke. Hi, I'm Inigo Anton and I'm racing in the Super Sporting Class. Hey, I'm Russell Cabrera and I race for the Sporting Class. My name is Miguel M. Sarmiento and I race in Sporting Class. I am Giro Garbes and I'm racing in the Sporting Class. Racing ever since has been my passion. Since my dad before, ever since I was a kid, was racing as well. So seeing him inspired me more to join racing and eventually they allowed me to race. And yeah, I got this opportunity to join the VS Cup thanks to Toyota Team Sundu. Well, I gotta say, you know, there's a lot of things that inspired me, but I could say also that it's always been my passion ever since I was young. Ever since, you know, I was a baby, my first words were car, car. So I think from then on, I already knew that I really wanted to race. And with my parents being uh, race car drivers also, international champions as well, it, you know, it just seemed like it was going to be meant to be. The Vios Cup car is actually the first race car I've ever driven, ever, in my life. Because I came from go-karting and not the competitive type of go-karting. I came from go-karting with my friends in high school. This should be everyone's first race car ever because it teaches you the basics. This year, we focus on prepping the car eh? and also getting more practice before the race week. Para during those practice times, then we check the cars so para when it comes race day, okay yung koche. So I know that I have to prepare to you know win a race, and there's a lot of time that is put into it, you know. And people usually don't see you know, the behind the scenes, but it's really as intense and as important. For someone like me who wasn't super interested in cars growing up, and as young as I am. Driving this kind of car on the streets make me more excited to drive it on the racetrack and to see what it can actually do when, I, when I'm in a safe space and I'm able to push the car to the limits. And you'll notice in every practice session that they're able to extract something in the, in the car. There's always something more that the car can do, as, as basic as you might think it is. What I really learned about racing, especially here at BS, is patience is key when it comes to racing here in life. In life, you really have to wait for those moments eh, in life. Hindi naman pwedeng rush lagi lahat eh. My dad before when he raced, he was called a gentleman racer. So considering that the sport is dangerous, I like to emulate how he raced back then to have fun, safety first, and play fair with my teammates and competitors. I don't think I know everything about racing yet. There's, there's still a very steep hill to climb in terms of um, circuit racing. But I'm very fortunate to be surrounded by people who have been in this sport for years and even decades. Coming here, we all just want to become better race car drivers. So there's really nothing to lose, and we're always gaining more experiences and just keep pushing ourselves to the limit every time we race here in the BS Cup. So I'm really grateful that I'm part of this series because, you know, it's definitely the most challenging series here in the Philippines. And to be at the top, you always gotta make no mistakes and always keep learning.